What is going on, you guys? Riley on Jemmy Inflatable Fans 98, and I got a really cool review for you guys today. This is the Jemmy 2018 9 foot tall airborne inflatable pirate archway. Um, this is a design that I thought was kind of meh at the start. Um, I wasn't really a huge fan of it um, until I saw like a picture of it. I actually I don't think my store had a store display, um, as far as I know. Uh, but I saw a picture of it, and I really liked it, and, uh, you know, I finally inflated mine in person for the first time, and I'm a little disappointed, I'll explain that in a minute. Um, but I ended up getting this guy 75% off at Lowe's, really the, actually the only inflatable I got on sale. All the other Halloween inflatables I unfortunately paid full price for, and a lot of them made it to the 50, 75% off sales, so I'm a little disappointed. Um, but hey, it's, it is what it is, I got them anyway. Um, but yeah, I paid $25 for this thing, I believe, um, which is a pretty good deal. Obviously, it's, I, I thought originally it was a brand new inflatable. It was a stupid mistake, but I never looked, I never opened up the flap on the top of the box to make sure it was taped. It, and uh, when I, I tried making this video before, of course, my phone ran out of storage, so you can hear it. It's actually inflated and running in the background. If you hear the inflatable in the background, that's this thing. Um, I made a video and I ran out of storage, um, so I had to. Re I'm just redoing it now. Um, but I'll explain to you guys what I mean by how I'm disappointed here. Um, so I'm gonna pause the video and I'll be right back. All right, guys. So here it is. Um, I really like this inflatable a lot. It's a really cool one. Um, I really like the little. I don't know what you call them. The little strands hanging down from the bottom there. That's a really cool touch. Um, I really like the light in the skull's head there. That's a really cool thing too. Um, but, of course, like I mentioned in the beginning of the video, this was not brand new, um, I, like I thought it was. Um, of course, a lot of these stores, Home Depot, Lowe's, I mean, really any store does it, and I think it's absolutely ridiculous. They never specify whether something was a return. They don't test it to see if it works or not. They just throw it back up on the shelf, and when someone comes in to buy it, they don't tell them anything, and, you know, sometimes you'll end up with a broken item. This isn't necessarily broken but it's not brand new. You can see there's a light out in that one. And usually, at least at Lowe's, if it's a store display, they usually put on the box that it was a store display. This one didn't have anything on the box, as you guys saw in the beginning of the video. Um, so my guess is this is a store return. Um, I can't exactly pinpoint where it was, but when I was inflating it for the first time in like the first video I was trying to make, um, I did see a spot on it that looked like it was sewn like like someone had ripped it and so sewed, sewed that little spot back up so that's another thing um and i'm just a little disappointed that you know obviously i got it for a good deal 25 bucks is a great deal i can't complain about that but i also really think that these stores should really specify whether their you know their products are store returns um because you know a lot of times especially when things are on clearance and their store returns they don't allow you to return them which is ridiculous um, I'm not going to end up returning this one. I mean, obviously the bulb right there is an easy fix. Um, I'm just, like I said, I'm just a little disappointed that, uh, you know, they never said this was a store return. Um, you know, uh, like I said, it works. I, I, I hate to be a complainer, but yeah. Uh, but nonetheless, guys, this is really cool. Uh, like I said, I really like the kaleidoscope light in the head or the fire and ice light, I should say. Uh, very, very cool. Uh, each of the torches has a, I think that's an LED light. It's not like an actual LED light. I think it's a warm LED light. Um, you can kind of see it looks like an LED with the color. Um, so like I said, that one actually when I was inflating it was kind of flickering. Like I thought maybe it had a short, because I like I said, I'd never seen these things in person. I thought maybe they had like a short circuit effect to them. Like the two little um, torches here. I thought that, was, that would be a really cool idea. Uh, I thought they had a short circuit effect, but they didn't. It was just a, the light burning out. <laughs> but uh, nonetheless, guys, this is really cool. Um, I mean, at this point, like I said, um, well, actually, I mentioned the beginning of the video. A lot of things did last to 75% off, like online, I guess. Um, but in store, around me, all the inflatables were sold out within, you know, literally the day after Halloween. Because most stores, like Home Depot and Lowe's at least, they usually go 50% off like a week before Halloween or a week before Christmas. And the 
day after Christmas, Lowe's at least goes 75% off, day after Christmas, day after Halloween. So you can expect a lot of people going in and grabbing stuff just at the 50% off sale, let alone the 75% off sale. Everything at the 75% off sale, you, you uh, give it two days and everything's pretty much gone. So um, if your guys' store still has one of these, I definitely recommend picking it up. It's a very cool inflatable. Um, I really do like it. Again, it wasn't a design I was really too keen about in the beginning of the season, but uh, like I said, after I saw some pictures and stuff, um, I really think this guy is really cool. So like I said, guys, if you have a, your store, you know, you think your store might have one of these, I definitely recommend going over and picking one up. It's a very cool inflatable. Um, hopefully, just as a warning again, you know, take my advice. Open up the box to make sure it's not, you know, the tape is, it's completely taped up because if it's, if it's not taped up, Chances are it's either a return or a store display. Um, so, anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed the review. Riley on Jimmy Inflatable Fans 98. Like and subscribe.